Can a AV8B Harrier Jump Yi fly backwards? Harrier Jump Jet perform crazy jump stunts on aircraft carrier. The McDonnell Douglas, now Boeing, AV8B Harrier II is a single-engine ground attack aircraft that constitutes the second generation of the Harrier family, capable of vertical or short takeoff and landing, D slash STOL. Named after a bird of prey, it was originally developed by British manufacturer Hawker Siddeley in the 1960s. The Harrier emerged as the only truly successful v slashed sto love design of the many attempted during that era. It was conceived to operate from improvised bases, such as car parks or forest clearings, without requiring large and vulnerable air bases. Later, the design was adapted for use from aircraft carriers. The Sea Harrier was a version made specially for use on aircraft carriers. Its amazing flying abilities give it the advantage over other planes in close combat. The aircraft is primarily employed on light attack or multi-role missions, ranging from close air support of ground troops to armed reconnaissance. The AV-8B is used by the United States Marine Corps, USMC, the Spanish Navy, and the Italian Navy. A variant of the AV-8B, the British Aerospace Harrier II. U.S. Army General Norman Schwarzkopf named the USMC Harrier II as one of several important weapons in the Gulf War. It also served in Operation Enduring Freedom in Afghanistan, the Iraq War, and subsequent war in Iraq, along with Operation Odyssey Dawn in Libya in 2011. The project that eventually led to the AV-8B's creation started in the early 1970s as a cooperative effort between the United States and United Kingdom aimed at addressing the operational inadequacies of the first-generation Hawker Siddeley Harrier. The Harrier entered service in 1967, and it is still in use today. The Harrier is also predicted that additional work on the aircraft's radars and sensor systems may take place. The USMC's Harrier II fleet was planned to remain in service until 2030. In the following, we will discuss seven actual facts about the McDonnell Douglas AV-8V Harrier Jump Jet Q. One, what happened to the Harrier Jump Jet? Italian and Spanish Harrier IAs have taken part in overseas conflicts in conjunction with NATO coalitions. In March 1996, the U.S. General Accounting Office GAO stated that it was less expensive to buy Harrier II plus aircraft outright than to remanufacture existing AV-8Bs. The U.S. estimated the cost for remanufacture of each aircraft to be $23 U.S. dollars $30 million. Two, why is the Harrier so good? The Harrier was the one that really got to grips with the vectored thrust. The ability to move the thrust from straight off, where you're flying like any other aeroplane and able to behave like any other aeroplane to straight down, where you are able to hover on a stack of air, and also everything in between that. Three, who still uses the Harrier jet? The Marine Corps currently retains 126 AV-8B and TAV-8B aircraft, with only 80 Harrier aircraft in active service as of 2018. Each fighter squadron operates 16 AV-8B Harrier jets. The Marine Corps currently plans to have all squadrons transition to or start to transition to the F-35 platform by 2026. 
Four. Do any countries still fly the Harrier? At present, the Boeing slashed BAE Systems AV-8B Harrier II is used by NATO countries such as the United States, Spain, and Italy. A modified version, the BAE Systems slash Boeing Harrier II is used by the Royal Air Force and the Royal Navy. Five, how long can Harrier fly? The Harrier can only hover for 90 seconds. In this time, it uses 150 gallons of water to keep the engine cool. To save fuel, a simple ramp allows the plane to take off on a very short runway. This is used by the Royal Navy carriers. The planes appear to hop into the air. Six, what is the accident rate of the Harrier jump jet? In the case of the Harrier jet, combat losses may in part be due to its slower speed and its role as a vertical takeoff jump jet driver between combat areas and aircraft carriers. The Class A mishap rate for the first model of the Harrier, the AV-8A was astronomical, 31 accidents per 100,000 hours. The Harrier jet is one of the most accident-prone aircraft in aviation history. By 2002, the Marine Corps lost more than one-third of its Harriers and 45 pilots to accidents, earning it the nickname, the Widowmaker. The La Times called it the most dangerous aircraft in the U.S. military. The Sea Harrier squadrons shot down 20 Argentine aircraft in air-to-air -air combat with no air-to-air -air losses, although two Sea Harriers were lost to ground fire and four to accidents. Seven. Can a Harrier jump jet fly backwards? The Harrier can also hover like a helicopter, fly sideways, go backwards, and even stop and turn in midair. It can do all this because its exhaust nozzles, from where exhaust gases come out, can swivel to change the direction of thrust from the Harrier's jet engine. All content on the Generation Fighter Jets channel is provided for educational purposes. Thumbnails, videos, and titles are for illustration only. So today's information, I hope it's useful and becomes knowledge for all of you. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you soon.